Okay, here we are again with the 6800 GS, or sorry, it's a 6800 with uh, the AGP model, the one that has been in the oven twice now, um, not because it didn't work, just because I didn't have it at the right temperature, so I um, turned the temperature up and put it through again. So I'm just going to do a dry run right now with power going to it to make sure it doesn't um, spark or short out. Looks good. Okay, so I'll put it back in the motherboard here. Um, it was a little, little longer than 10 minutes, so it was probably about 12 minutes on 200 degrees. So, like, a, a total of 12 minutes. Um, if you want to include both temperatures, it was probably about 20 minutes in the oven in total. And, uh, let's see what happened. Oh, it's even worse! <laughs> oh, that's crazy. Well, there you go. There's proof of concept that putting your video card in the oven will not fix it. Because it's actually worse than it was before. Yep, it's worse now than it was before. I'd say that looks a little worse. Well, there you go. I hope that explains it for you. Um, if your card is dead, obviously you can try this, because it's not going to make it any worse, but, uh, as you can see, it did actually make it worse. But it's not like I was using it, so I don't really care. Well, that sucks, I was kind of hoping that would work. Well, there you go. Putting your video card in the oven does not work on all video cards anyway because yeah it actually made it worse so uh... yeah well i might just try putting the card in the oven again only the other way up and we'll see what happens